Hey guys, you're my here from the crew, and today we are playing Concludes episode 4 or 5. I'm pretty sure this will be the ending of Concludes, so let's get to it. So, we're still stuck in the subway cars cart area. There's A, B, and C. But I'm not 100% sure what I'm supposed to do. Because it's giving me the things, but it's not telling me what to do with them. So, I guess I'm just going to go and turn some levers. I don't know. Oh, I didn't check this one, did I? One from down there. Do you need help, sir? Alright. Oh, there we go. Excuse me, old lady. So I need to do something with these levers over here. From the last episode. Now I turned on the generator and all that, so... Oh, 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 oh. In Velvet. Hear water draining somewhere. Hear water draining somewhere. Hear water draining somewhere. Cool. I guess I did something. Now I can see the laptop from all the way over here. So, there's, so, A drained the water from over there, but B drained the water from over here, which I want to go look at. What's going on in here? Lamp, metal key, subway car three key. Alright. Anything else? So I can go this way. Oh, that just brings me that way. I guess let's go this way. Um. Subway car 3. Cool. I'm not ready to go down yet. I guess I'm... Am going down? Yeah, I'll go down. Dude's down here. So, that means I'm gonna have to wrap around. This way. Descend. Oh, this isn't as nearly scary as I thought. Here's something. The computer. That's what it is. Computer or not? Okay. Something powered up nearby. Oh, the elevator. Yeah, you gotta go up. It. You gotta go down to go up. up there. Bless you. Whoa. Just walk right through there. <clears throat> so now I'm guessing I can go up. Power's on. Take the lift. Ooh. Get out of here.
Why am I back in here? I don't like this place. I said I'm running. Let's go. Appears to be a horse shaped object needs to be inserted into the door. Alright. What? That's a little buggy. So, it wants me to go this way, but let's not. His expression is hollow. Alright. You pull out, and there's a metal box behind it. It's a block of filament. Metal with a low meeting point. Picked up the filament block. Alright. I think the hind nuts. Journey the painting on the wall, but you can't tell whether the artist's intention was. The painting smells awful. Oh. Throw the bucket. You put hold a level. I how put the block of filament in the bucket because obviously that's something that you would need to do. Alright, so I can't put in half the box of the horse. I need the full horse. That's nice. Red painting is mesmerizing. The red sores from the painting seem to be spreading onto the floor. Metal block. With a low- yeah, I already had one of these. Oh. Is the inscription on the painting reading, it's the party in hell. The party goers, the painting has an emotionless expression. Okay, so let's go lower it down again. Pull the bar of filament and then get the other half. That's just how it works. I'm not questioning it. It's just how it works. The horse, yeah, 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 I know. Oh. Cool. The text textures are a little weird, but it's a great game. Bong, bong, bong. I can't read these. Yesterday, the man came into our school. Mrs. Phillips tried to hold the door, but he shot her in the head. Then he shot all of us. I thought I was dead, but then I woke up here. We were all scared because we all were alone, but Owen said we had to have to stick together. Everything was okay at first. We found a big school. It was empty and the lights were out, but Owen said we had to find food. So we had to be brave. Katie would not stop crying. She said she kept seeing shakers. I know what that means and how that I think about it. These people that shake. I thought she was lying out. Then I started to see them too. Soon everyone could see them. We all had to leave the school because Jessica, L, got really sad and let a shaker get her. She kept crying for her mommy. It ate her. Caleb's diary. Caleb from the sewers. What? This class is really sad about what happened to Jessica, but Owen said, We don't have time to be sad. We hiked for a day and we were able to find a big hospital. There were enough beds inside for everyone. For every student. Everything... Everything, see, see me, 
or when we went to sleep, but when we woke up, me, Katie, and Owen were the only ones left. We checked again and again for the... We checked again and again, but the beds were all empty. Everyone was gone. Katie was... Oh, Katie and Owen and me spent today trying to find some food, but everything we found smelled really bad. Owen noticed that daytime is really short here, and it seems like it always is night found an empty apartment near the hospital. Then we were able to get a working TV. All it played was static. During the night, me and Owen woke up and Katie was screaming. We heard it all around us. It wasn't until we looked up and it stopped. Katie was on the ceiling, shaking like one of those things. As we looked up at her, she stopped shaking. She just stared at us and made weird noises. Owen asked her to come down, but she didn't seem to hear. She faded into the ceiling. Owen says she's probably gone forever. Sad face. Ow. These headphones are really tight and I don't like them, but I'm working with what I have for now. Owen was upset. I was too. Katie made such weird faces when she was looking at us with nowhere to go. We were lucky we found a sewer key. The sewer key seemed scary at first, but it... The sewer. The sewer seemed empty at first, but it's empty. Scary at first, but it's empty. We have been staying in the sewers for a few days now. Hopefully we will continue to be safe. Owen disappeared. Sad face. He went for a pee and never came back. I went looking for him, but all I found was his shoes. Now I'm all alone. And even worse, creatures have started appearing in the sewers. Floors have suddenly became roasted and covered in human organs. It's too dangerous to leave my hiding spot, so I spent a lot of time in the darkness. It's so lonely here. Caleb. Hello? Loading. This is the second loading screen in the whole game. I can't do anything. I hope I don't have to do anything. Whoa. Whoa. Is this a boss fight? I should have saved. Oh no. Can I save? Yes I can. Save here. Caleb. Save over Caleb. There we go. Did I delete Caleb by overwriting his save file? I don't want to be here anymore. I'm losing control of my body. I can't stop shaking. I'm going to the surface. Hopefully I can make it. Caleb's final entry. So I overwrote Caleb. Glad I had the urge to save Highway Key. Now I gotta go all the way back. Oh no I don't. I know where this is. I still don't know what that says, but now I can get out into the highway. So that was a weird mechanic. I had to save over Caleb's file. All right. Yeah, I know the other way was faster, but I just went this way. Shut up. All right. We are getting close. This is probably the end, although I don't know where my wife is, which is what the whole purpose was 
of me being here. Well, I like being able to run this fast. Like, so I'm a little confused on the, like, the story, but I'm pretty sure I'm about censored key. Yeah, I can, pretty sure I can get out now. This was the highway key, so. I say, I'm still, I saved over Caleb's save file. To kill him. I think I killed him. I don't know exactly where I'm going, but let's go. I hope I don't get hit by a car. That would, that would really suck. Cordova Forest Service. Save, but so Caleb is still here. <gasps> Car. Oh no, it's not. <gasps> Need a quarter to make a call, Carolyn. Shut up, Google. Oh, she didn't answer. I'm starting to see a trend of her not answering. Tonight's stranger, tonight's strange weather has caused a mudslide and down several large trees. Terry left the pillow somewhere in the woods. Plow somewhere in the woods, not pillow pillow in the woods. We're going to need to find it and start clearing things before tomorrow morning. There should be a diesel in the utility room. Be careful. Cut there. Okay. I have a lot of quarters. I cannot look at the painting. So, is Kill dead? Because I pretty much saved over his file. Utility room key. I like how I know exactly what these keys are and what their use is. So where's the utility room? Ah. Yeah, I thought that was a car. So I guess I need to find... Crash school bus. Alright. I heard him. I don't. Alright. Is this the mudslide? Okay. This is the utility room. Nothing. Herb. Herb number five. Alright, guess I can't. It's not like I could shimmy over those two trash cans, but I guess I can't. Alright, so. Doors unlocked. Check out what's in here. Cool. Amazing. This is wonderful. I am glad I came in here. Oh. Uh, Sarah Cambers. To anyone that finds this, I'm trapped in the bathroom. I walked home through the park after school because it was a nice day out. I'd go to the bathroom, so I stepped inside for a minute. Now the door won't open, and there's a creepy lady in the last stall. She has really long hair. She keeps pulling it out and throwing it onto the floor. She... Cool. 
I'll make a phone call real quick. Call mom. She didn't answer. Wonderful. Okay. Door's locked. Alright, here we go. Look at all this diesel. There isn't much of it left. Picked up a diesel can. Hey, moron. Terry. Why did your stupid leave the plow out in the middle of the park? A bunch of little jerks filled the tank with sand. Managed to drain it out, but to refill the tank with diesel, and I managed to drain it out, but you'll need to refill the tank with diesel and bring it back to the Forest Service office. Since you're stupid, probably doesn't know how to prime a diesel engine, I'll take you through it. Number one, fill the tank with diesel. Duh. Number, number two, pump and bleed the screw. Pump and bleed screw. The pump and the bleed screw are located near the fuel filter on the engine. The primer pump will be the large button. Loosen the bleed screw and allow the air to leave the fuel line. Pump the primer for 10 minutes or until you see fuel coming from the bleed screw. Tighten the bleed screw until there is no leaking. Start the engine. Okay, so pretty much. Fill it, loosen the bleed screw, pump until the bleed, until fuel comes from the bleed screw, start engine, or tighten screw, and start the engine. So I need to go to the park now. Where's the park? I'm guessing the park is at the highway. I mean, back inside the town. That would make sense. Or is it over here? I can't go this way. So. One long bridge. Thanks for confirming that. I love how I'm not worried about this bus. So. They left it in the park. Now the park, I'm guessing, is back this way. A defiled human corpse? Can't read that. Dead end. Alright. You know, that makes me wonder, why am I still alive? Like, I'm, I'm no better than anyone else. They left the plow here. Where would the plow be? I'm guessing this way, because over here didn't have much of a use. Can't run very fast in the town all of a sudden. Okay, so the plow should be here somewhere, right? Ah. Uh, I do not see the plow anywhere. So, maybe it's somewhere else. Looking for a plow. Looking for a plow. I'm looking for a plow. This is a park, right? I would assume it's a park. So, I don't see any plow here. There's no plow here. Doo -doo. Ow, ow, ow. Alright. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the video once I get up to here. At the save point.
and then I will record later the next episode because I'm gonna end it here mainly because ow my ears hurt so bad from these stupid headphones all right thank you guys so much for watching this is Jeremiah from the crew and goodbye <laughs>